On the night of October 18th, Aero Linea's Argentina's flight AR1133 from Madrid to Buenos Aires encountered severe turbulence after flying over the Atlantic and reaching the Brazilian coast. This extreme turbulence resulted in the injury of 12 passengers. Let's look at this incident more closely in today's video. Unfortunately, several passengers were taken to Hospital de Ezeza for treatment and observation. In total, there were 271 passengers and 13 crew aboard the Airbus A330-200, registered Lima Victor Foxtrot Victor Hotel. The turbulence was so severe that some emergency equipment fell from the ceiling and some overhead panels cracked. Because of the situation, the crew requested that medical services meet the plane in Buenos Aires where nine passengers were treated on site. A further three passengers were taken to the hospital with minor injuries. A statement from Aero Linus Argentinus is as follows. According to the information provided by the crew, the fastened seatbelt signs were on and an announcement had been made. The passengers who suffered most and were taken to the hospital did not have their seatbelts fastened when the aircraft encountered turbulence. According to a passenger on flight AR1133, the airline's statement contradicts his own experience. Interviewed by Argentinian media outlet Clarin, stated that the fastened seatbelt sign had in fact not been turned on. While these details will be crucial for investigators, many airlines do announce to passengers that even if the fastened seatbelt sign is turned off, passengers should fasten their seatbelt while they are sitting in their seats. This common directive is due to the fact that unexpected turbulence can happen at any moment. Aero Linus Argentinus has eight Airbus A330-200s in its fleet at the moment, with the incident aircraft Lima Victor Foxtrot Victor Hotel being nearly eight years old. The aircraft was delivered to the airline brand new from Boeing in 2015. This particular jet is special in that its livery is a unique design dedicated to the national football team of Argentina, a livery that has only been on the aircraft for a few weeks now. All of the airline's A330-200s are configured with 24 seats in business class and 248 seats in economy. Aerolineas Argentinas operates its 10,086km or 6,267-mile 6 service from Buenos Aires to Madrid once per day. This is the airline's second longest route, while its longest service connects Buenos Aires to Rome. Flights to Rome, however, are only operating four times per week at the moment. Despite whatever light damage was sustained to the aircraft, the A330 is back in the air again. The aircraft has since flown from its home in Buenos Aires to destinations like Cancun, Miami, El Calafate and Ushuaia. What do you think of this incident? Do you keep your seatbelt fastened even if the sign is turned off? Share your thoughts by leaving a comment. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.